Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, vintage badge or label animation in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. This tutorial template is available for free, you can download it from below link in the description. Now let's start with our tutorial. Let's create a new composition. Name it as badge or label. As usual set width and height to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Make sure frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Set time duration to 8 seconds. Perfect. Now we need to create triangle shape. So select star tool. Let's set stroke width to 5. Let's draw star. Perfect. Now in poly star 1. For poly star path 1. Change point to 3. Now change rotation to 60 degrees. Perfect. Now let's align it to the center. Now position anchor point to the center. Now let's rename it. Name it as frame 1. Now let's create duplicate of frame 1. Press Ctrl plus D to create it. Now for frame 2. Change stroke value to 10. Now for frame 2. Press S to bring up scales. Let's increase scale value. Perfect. Now let's add the text. Now for text let's change the fill color to black. Let's set stroke color to white. Perfect. Now let's align the text to center. You can also adjust the position of your text. Now let's animate our text. For text layer, let's add tracking. Go to animate, select tracking. Now in range select a 1. Make sure you are at start of the timeline. Now create a keyframe for start. Go at 2 seconds. Now change start value to 100%. Now for range select a 1, we will add position. From property. Select Position. Now adjust Position value for Y axis as shown. Now you can see the preview. Now add Property, Opacity. Now change Opacity to 0%. Let's see the preview. Perfect. Now select created keyframe, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Let's see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create a shape layer. Select pen tool. This is the simplest method to draw the shape. First create a rectangle shape layer. Now change stoke to none. Set fill color to solid. You can change solid shape fill color here. Now make sure you have selected the shape layer. Now select the center pointer. 
you need to adjust its position and pointers as shown. Take your time and create a perfect shape. Now make sure you have not selected any shape layer. Now draw shape as shown. Now change fill option to none. Now change stroke option to solid color. Now let's increase the stroke value in such a way that it hides the whole shape layer 1. Now for shape layer 2, add trim path. At 2 seconds. For trim path 1. Create a keyframe for start. Now at 2 seconds and 20 frames. Change start value to 100%. Now select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. For shape layer 1, change track math to, alpha inverted math shape layer 2. Now you can see the preview. Now let's add another text. Now let's animate it. Make sure you have selected the text layer. Now select pen tool. Now draw mask as shown. Now you need to adjust the mask path as shown. Now for text layer. In text, go to mask path options. Now change mask path to mask 1. Now in transform, Adjust the position value for text layer. Now add 3 seconds. Create a keyframe for first margin. Now add 2 seconds and 15 frames. Adjust first margin value as shown. Now select both keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Perfect. Now draw mask covering our text. Now you can see the preview. Perfect.
Now let's add the text. Let's change text color to white. Let's off the stroke color. Now let's add another text. Now for unique text. Press P to bring up the position. Now add 3 second and 20 frames. Create keyframe for position. Now add 3 seconds, change position value for x axis as shown. Perfect. Now select both keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Perfect. Now you need to do the same for style text layer. Press P to bring up the position. Now add 3 second and 20 frames, create keyframe for position. Now add 3 seconds. Change position value for x axis as shown. Perfect. Now select both keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Perfect. Now make sure you have not selected any layer. Now select rectangle tool. Now draw shape covering text layer. Now for stroke option, change it to none. Now for fill, change it to solid color. Now for shape layer, position it above the unique text layer. For unique text layer, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 3. Now you need to do the same for style text layer. Now draw shape covering text layer. For style text layer, change track mat to alpha mat shape layer 4. You are free to adjust the position for text layer, you can place it wherever you want. Now let's animate the frame. Now select frame 1. From Add, select Trim Path. Now add 3 seconds. Create keyframe for start and end. Now change end value to 0%. Now add 3 second and 20 frames. Change start value to 100%. Now add 3 second and 25 frames. Create keyframe for start. Now change end value to 100%. Now add 4 seconds. Change start and end value to 0%. Now add 5 seconds and 20 frames. Change end value to 100%. Now select all created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now let's see the preview. Perfect.
Now for frame 2. From add, select trim path. Now for trim path. At 4 seconds. Create a keyframe for start. Change start value to 100%. Now at 5 seconds and 20 frames. Change start value to 0%. Now select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now select pen tool. Now draw shape layer is shown. Perfect. Now place it above frame 1 layer. Now for frame 1, change track mat to alpha inverted shape layer 5. Now create a duplicate of shape layer 5. Press Ctrl plus D to create it. Place it above frame 2. Now for frame 2, change track mat to alpha inverted shape layer 6. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Here are vintage badges created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.